So you've been hearing this thing called architectural mesh, but what exactly is it? Is it right for my project? Well, stick around and I'll tell you everything you need to know about architectural wire mesh. Hi there, my name's Wendy, and all over the globe, architects seek new and innovative materials to implement into their architectural design process. And one of those innovative materials is architectural wire mesh. But what exactly is it? Having worked in the world of architectural design for over 20 years, WS Tyler is here to help you become an architectural mesh expert and determine if it's right for you. So in this video, we'll establish what architectural mesh is, its applications, its variation, and its pricing. Architectural wire mesh is high tensile grade 316 stainless steel mesh that is commonly produced from 80% recycled material. Similar to the clothes that we wear, the material consists of several individual wires that are woven on large weaving looms to create beautiful woven patterns. While woven wire mesh appears rigid and unyielding at first glance, the material is rather flexible when produced over certain lengths. This allows it to be used in a variety of applications. Because of its versatile properties, architectural mesh is an ideal design solution for both exterior and interior applications. Outfitting a structure with a mesh facade is one of the most common uses of architectural mesh. It's because mesh facades provide a sleek, one-of-a-kind appearance for arenas, commercial buildings, conference centers, educational institutions, parking garages, stadium theaters, and much more. For example, the same facade can appear reflective or transparent depending on a number of factors. They can even modernize an existing building by fusing classic and contemporary design elements. Mesh elements can be used to create effective canopies. By using architectural mesh panels to deflect or filter sunlight, architects can better moderate the indoor climate. In fact, woven wire mesh provides shade and reduces the temperature in the summer while maintaining warmth and reducing heating costs in the winter. Despite efficient sun protection, mesh canopies also offer transparent views from the inside of the structure. Architectural mesh is an excellent material for balustrades and other infill panels. The mesh, which is made of corrosion resistant stainless steel, adds a textile elegance to balconies, bridges, guardrails, staircases, or terraces while maintaining safety and stability standards. Also, infill panels with mesh elements create different optical effects depending on the viewing angles. Mesh offers a timeless blend of luxury and versatility. For that reason and its ability to be manipulated, it's the ideal material for free configuration projects. Whether it's aviaries, exhibitions, or various design objects, the versatile properties of wire mesh provide nearly limitless possibilities. Mesh is suited for interior applications too. Installing a mesh ceiling combines sophisticated aesthetics with functional benefits. Decorative mesh panels can be used to conceal unslightly technical installations while adding another layer of protection. In addition, lighting the mesh from different angles can achieve a number of appearances from a shimmering finish to an opaque shell to a semi-transparent design. Mesh panels are also an excellent choice for interior walls. Its exclusive appearance can be used to accentuate features within the room or serve as the highlight of the space itself. And similar to the ceiling panels, it can be used as cladding to conceal and protect technical installations. And finally, mesh is an ideal material for creating an acoustically effective environment. The round wires scatter sound in different directions and serve as a support for acoustic materials. So basically, there's four weave types that can be applied. These types are wire mesh, cable mesh, fine mesh, and specialty mesh. Wire mesh is the most common diversified mesh for exterior applications. It provides architectural designers with a tremendous amount of customization value. With wire mesh, you can change the opening size of the mesh a lot easier. Wire diameter in both the weft and warp direction can be customized and flat wire can be used. And when it comes to the cost, the weight is the biggest determining factor. The more stainless steel used, the heavier the material. The heavier the material, the higher the price. And mesh types with more open area will track toward the cheaper end of the spectrum. Cable mesh is, for the most part, similar to wire mesh in the fact that materials are woven on weaving looms. The major difference is that the wires that run vertically, known as the warp wires, are actually cables. When it comes to using cable mesh, the main advantage over traditional wire mesh is its flexibility. To put this into perspective, let's say you want to incorporate a facade that requires a lot of bends and curves. To accommodate this aesthetic, you would more than likely be limited to cable mesh as you risk damaging the rigid wires used in traditional wire mesh. Cable mesh tends to be more expensive than wire mesh because of the vertical cables that are incorporated into its design. And while the cables themselves are inexpensive, 
They must be spot welded to prevent any fraying. Fine mesh weaves are, well, vastly finer than a standard wire mesh weave. Its cloth-like characteristics provide a unique aesthetic that's unlike any other solution. That said, this particular type of mesh is typically used for interior applications, such as wall coverings and elevator caps. It's because the fine wires are very delicate and may be damaged when exposed to natural elements like gale winds as well as hail. And for cost, fine mesh tends to be lighter but the structure of it makes each pattern more difficult to weave. The fine weaving loom must be set up to accommodate the design. Labor is the defining fact here, as it can take several days to set up the loom. Custom mesh profiles offer unique patterns, both interior and exterior applications, and it can possibly utilize the look of several different wire types. Unique colors and shapes can also be applied and can offer a solution that is truly one of a kind. But typically, specialty mesh is used for very specific applications and is seldom used on an entire facade system. And for cost, custom patterns require more fabrication and therefore more labor. In addition, the designs are drastically different, making accurate estimation tough. No matter which material you choose for your project, you'll be provided all the material and metrics needed to get the job done. So in purchasing mesh, the price includes these main factors. The mesh, standard mounting, standard hardware, structural calculations, shop drawing, engineering services, and one on-site delivery. What the price does not include is the substructure that attaches the mounting to the building or the installation. Both the substructure and the installation are handled by miscellaneous metals contractors, subcontractors, or general contractors of your choosing. When it comes to the overall cost of mesh material you use for a project, there are several factors that need to be taken into account. These factors include quantity, dimensions, and fabrication. So, for example, the smaller the quantity of mesh needed for the project, the higher the cost per square foot. On the other hand, the higher the quantity of the mesh needed for the project, the lower the cost per square foot. So in other words, mass production allows for a more cost-efficient project. I also wanted to mention valued engineering, which is when architectural designers begin to eliminate certain elements of the structure to make the overall project more budget friendly. While omitting architectural mesh altogether seems like an obvious remedy to funding issues, designers must take into consideration that architectural mesh does provide weather protection, fall protection, and security. Luckily, architectural wire mesh is extremely customizable and can be manipulated to fit almost any budget. The wire diameter and the mesh openings can be made larger or smaller while also maintaining the aesthetic vision and price point of the designer. Thanks so much for watching. If you have any questions, fill out the contact us form so we can answer your specific questions. Just click the link in the description. And if you'd like to learn more about our woven wire mesh or many products, we have a learning center filled with written and video content to make you an expert. Click the second link and you'll be that expert in no time. And don't forget to click that subscribe button and ring that bell to keep up with all things WS Tyler. Once again, my name is Wendy and I'll see you around in the next video. Bye for now.